This is the Mercedes Marco Polo camper. It's had quite a lot of press coverage, maybe because it's a Mercedes. And you can see here, it got a prize as a uh, Rise Mobile of the Year, um, camper of the F1 Pro Mobile, uh, with a price tag of 56,000 euros, however. Um, it's very, very steep, and for that type of money, you can get a proper motorhome. Now, let's have a look inside, and certainly it's a Mercedes, and what you get as a Mercedes, it's very nicely equipped as a car. It's absolutely, uh, absolutely outstanding. It does look a lot like my former VW camper uh, in uh, basic layout. Of course, my VW camper was made... 24 years ago and let's come over here well it's um it's got th things here which are a lot more uh, interesting than my camper was i'll put some light on that so we can see what we're doing and so we've got a basin uh hobs very very nice and here we have a built-in fridge it's not one that you pull out that you might get in other vehicles so the westphalia uh fridge and we have a table that runs across, we have some hanging space at the back and we have a bed down here and a bed up here. I do however think that if you can afford 56,000 euros you're probably not going to be sleeping for adults in something like this. Now the point I would like to make about a vehicle like this is as I said earlier you can buy a proper motorhome for that type of money so maybe you want to use it as a car and if you do want to use it uh, as a car with the conversion the extra money that you're paying for the conversion m would mean that's an awful lot of hotel nights thrown in there so uh, that's something you would want to consider another thing of course it is, it is a car so it, you can gonna park it anywhere you want. Um, it's got a lot of style, it looks nice, but from a practical point of view, I would say get yourself a proper motorhome if you've got this type of money.